Okay, what about now? Oh, it crashed. Okay, cool. <laughs> okay, sick. Hi, Greg. Thank you for the 54 months. Um, apparently, you don't cause therapists. You don't because therapists don't say that, obviously. Yeah, um, I was actually just talking to myself. And then everyone clapped. <laughs> People are so weird. Yay, it worked. All right, let's go, besties. Um, we started this one like a year or two ago, and then I never finished it. We only played like an hour of it, so I know nothing. Excellent, thank you. Thank you for the gift, so just so sweet. I know, some of the responses are so weird. Someone else was like, someone else was like, um, you know, your therapist also wants to control you. And I was like, what? Who's? Not mine. <laughs> My therapist doesn't give a shit. She's like, you're free to make your own mistakes. I don't know. People are so weird. I feel like people view therapists as like robots that are trained to respond to you in certain ways. But like therapists are all people. They're all going to have different biases, different judgments, different viewpoints, different scope of how they view the world. Like it's all going to be different because they're people like, yeah, people are so weird. Anyways, amateur. I'm not that smart. Dear Bess. <laughs> Annie, thank you for the prime set for two years. Happy two year anniversary. Therapists are people. Newsflash. Nancy, after years of trying, I finally got George a spot on her favorite adventure reality show, Pacific Run. I have to read this like I'm five. Excuse me. You have no idea how excited she is to have you on her team. This season's Pacific Run takes place in New Zealand. So pack your bags and get ready for action. I've been telling everyone I know you're going to be this season's winners, so don't let a best down. If you've been training as much as George, there's no way you'll lose. <laughs> I can't wait to cheer you two on from the comfort of a swanky hotel, I hope. Go Team Tui, Bess. <laughs> on a scale of one to Disney Channel, how is my voice? <clears throat> Pacific this season of Pacific Run is holding <clears throat> nothing back. Let's meet the contestants who are about to take the ride of a lifetime. Former rugby star Patrick simply wrote, No known allergies cannot swim. <laughs> Kiri, team Tawaki. She broke hearts on date panic. What? Climbed to the top single-handedly in Biggest Cheater. And along with partner Aaron, she's here to make her mark on the country she calls home. Next, Lena, team Kia. International cryptology consultant by day. Quote, unquote, none of your business the rest of the time good for her she's an accountant next up a young woman after my own heart my personal favorite george fane <gasps> our girl george all that good okay i'm sunny i'm the line producer sunny game phone keep an eye on your phone for updates from the announcer when you get a medallion bring it back to the stand the producer areas are off limits very off limits your rules are in your tent read the rules the first team to finish a stage gets the highest score. Second team gets the second highest and so on. Keep an eye out for extra missions. Sometimes the perks will be even better than the points. You can still win coming in second or third once in a while. My plan requires many specific talents. <laughs> Whoa, you're not supposed to hear that. I have to go. And we're off. Time for our teams to build up some steam. Solve the rails puzzle to find your very own Pacific Run data chip. Guard okay. with your life. Your team chip will give you access to new locations to explore, puzzles to solve, and challenges to overcome. Okay. <laughs> um, Sunny has been like an Easter egg in like every Nancy Drew game. Maybe not every single one, but like he leaves a mark of like Sunny was here in so many games. That's Time our to boy. Get tracks together. Do I have to rotate? Oh, am I just switching? Okay, cool. Oh, that one stays in place. Okay, so that will be um, this one. Uh, maybe this is here. I'm not sure. I don't know. I don't know, gamers. Um, maybe it is. Mm. It doesn't look like it matches that much. Mm. Mm. I'm trying to go by like the reflection. One vote! <laughs> we won by one vote! 
Mm, no. Uh, could it be this one? Maybe. Maybe. Excuse me. Excuse me. Uh, I don't know. I think this is right. So maybe. Mm, no. Okay. Never mind. I'm wrong. Or maybe it's that. Oh! Wait, what? Wait, wait, wait. I'm so confused. <laughs> Twains. Hi, Venom. How are you? How you doing? What? Where do you go? Maybe this doesn't go here because this is like very bright, but this didn't. Oh, I think that's where that goes. Uh, uh, oh. Mmm, <laughs> I see. <laughs> uh. Wow. <laughs> Noel, please. This Noel. Looks useful. Congratulations, Team Tui. You solved the trains. To win your first medallion piece, use the chip to access other locations and find the following five plants. Mount Cook Lily, Waterfall Fern, Pikau, Kakabik, and a Spider Orchid. Place the plants in the correct vase on your team's plant stand. There's an item in your tent that will help. Okay, bye. Bye bye. Where is my tent? Looks like I'll need something to activate that chip. <gasps> Hello? Map locations locked. You'll need to discover the passwords. The first can be found at Puzzle Palace. I can't believe they're just throwing us into puzzles already. I'm so surprised. Where is Puzzle Palace? <gasps> uh. Looks like I can use a <gasps> sheep to buy things. Did you guys know that the population of sheep in um in uh New Zealand is higher than the amount of people? <laughs> wow, that took me too long to say. Oh god. <clears throat> Oh, catching up on what? In 1773, the first sheep set hoof in New Zealand. <laughs> Brought by Captain James Cook on his second voyage to the country. The unlucky ew and ram lived only a few days. Oh, that's sad. It was, an in, it was an inauspicious beginning to New Zealand's long association with sheep farming. Sheep farming was established in the 1840s when a large shipment of merino sheep arrived from Australia. Sheep farming quickly became the most important agricultural industry and wool was the most valuable export for over 100 years. Shearing occurs annually on the South Island and twice a year on the North Island. Herds are brought to shearing stations where professionals use me mechanized clippers with specialized blades to shear each sheep. The skill of the workers is celebrated at yearly shearing and wool handling competitions. The sheep wool is a super fiber, fireproof, waterproof, and 100% natural. It even generates heat when wet. Ooh, generates heat when wet? <clears throat> wool can be used for everything from luxury knitwear to building insulation. Other fibers can be blended with wool, such as merino possum yarn. This yarn blends fur from the invasive Australian bush, brush tail possum with merino wool to create a blend better capable of retaining heat than merino alone. Other products of the sheep farming industry include lanolin, a natural grease recovered from raw she sheared wool. Why is this so hard to talk? <clears throat> a natural grease recovered from raw sheared wool and frequently used in cosmetics. Chem chemois cloth? 
from sheepskin, dairy products, and wool pads for oil spills. Woolly jumpers have even been knitted for blue penguins to keep them warm after being rescued from an oil spill. Oh, they make little sweaters for the penguins. That's really freaking cute. That's so sweet. <clears throat> it does get hot when wet. It sure does. 20 in each row and column unlocks blades. 20 in each row and column unlocks blades. I didn't bring my notebook today. I should probably go get it. Oh, and then there's breed. I don't really want to read the breeds. Let me go get my notebook before I regret it. Because I will regret it. Okay. Woohoo! Going off topic, and I don't know if you answered this already, but uh, are you going to rank all the songs? Yes. Yes, I will. Okay. Okay, <clears throat> let's put these down. <clears throat> or steal it, that works too. This feels like an unlucky advantage, or an unfair advantage. Um, where did they say I was supposed to go? Is it the puzzle house? <clears throat> oh, check out Puzzle Palace. Haven't done that. Where is Puzzle Palace? Oh, base camp. <gasps> People! Is that George? All right. Let's start looking for those plants. Ah! You do the footwork and I'll research where they might be. Oh, okay. Can I talk to anyone else? Uh, what? Huh? Are you excited to be on Pacific Run? What? I suppose. Lean said we're going to be on TV. And I said, should I pack? You weren't <coughs> excited. I've been on TV before. You don't <laughs> notice it when it's happening. It doesn't feel any different than regular life. It's like you make a tiny clone of yourself for people to yell at. I disagree. When there's a bunch of like shining lights in your face, it's a little overwhelming. Oh my God. Nancy Drew with Twitch integration would be fun. His accent sounds Come accurate on. to me, but. Talk to you another time. I'm, I'm not Kiwi, now. but it sounds, it sounds Kiwi to me. Oh God, I don't know. <laughs> This must be I don't the show's know. Confession booth. Hmm. Mm. <laughs> talking to myself. Wait, what, Daniel? Oh my God, it's gonna be critical. I'll read about it later. It's fine. Crew only. Let's head no, back here. Back there. Oh. At least not while the security cameras are active. Nancy, what are you trying to say? What? I wasn't trying to. Oh, I have more. What happened? How did you get into professional rugby? I played until I was really good. Is that all? I was facing down the river. What's that mean? When you're in the river, it's not a real river. I can't swim. I won't go in a real river. Okay, no one's gonna make you. My parents' students worry if they're in the river. It's supposed to push you to your self-discovery. Like destiny? Okay. My mother told me when you were in a river, you do what it says. Hmm. You don't fit the image I have of a professional athlete. What does that mean, Nancy? You don't fit the image I have of a professional athlete. People say that to me. You seem very humble. Most athletes are. Not the ones I've heard of. Exactly. That's good too. Write it down. What? <laughs> what? Do you think there's anything odd about this competition? Yes. What's that? But I'm here? I don't like competition. Weren't you a pro rugby player? Rugby is a sport. Right. A competitive sport. This is silly. All these rules. Too many rules. I mean, he's not wrong. Rugby is like hardcore football. Rugby, they have like no protection at all. Like every rugby match, people leave bleeding. It's wild. Yeah, he's so confusing. What is going on with him? I think it was him. He he did the murder. Can you tell me a little more about your family? Why? I'm just naturally a curious person. And you wouldn't fit in with my family. They all seem to know stuff. I never fit in. <laughs> Have you ever spoken more than five words? You're very vague about what your parents do. Why? I never thought to ask. 
It's just ideas. Ideas aren't dangerous until you try to bottle them up. But that's what people always do with ideas they think are dangerous. That's a profound thought. Please write it down. <laughs> I love him and I hate him at the same time. Himbo is being generous, yes. Game is a little quiet. Okay, I'll turn it up in a second. I've never met anyone who announces their profound thoughts so directly. Sure you have. They just say it's smarter and have better memories. Bye. Yeah. Talk to you another time. All right, let me turn this up a little bit. It's locked. It's just it was so... Oh, it's because I turned it... It's I turned locked. the volume down when we started the game because it was so loud. Okay, I turned it up a bit, so that should be better. Where is this puzzle palace? Is it here? Is this it? Puzzle palace, let's go! This looks like an arcade. I need to find all of the differences. Oh, I love these. Easy. Easy. Wait, between all of these? I'm confused. Or, okay. How are these connect- I'm so confused how these are connecting. What else? I don't know how they're going like across and... Oh, do they all... Wait, how does this work? Dun dun, dun dun, dun dun, dun dun. What am I missing? I feel like I should just click on everything and see what comes up. <laughs> just click on every object. There's still three? Bucket. Bucket. <clears throat> Uh, I should figure out what these letters spell. Which ones? Da shall we? Da shall we? <laughs> yeah, just click everything. Oh, unscramble for password to Mossburn. Oh. Oh, what? Oh, no. Wool. Shed. All right, I did it. <laughs> I knew exactly what I was doing. Quake Shack. Oh my God, it's an earthquake. Oh my God, let me out. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Oh my god. <clears throat> Yoink. <laughs> this is mine now. I don't know what I'm going to need it for, but it's mine. What is this? Oh no, I hate this game. No, I refuse. I won't play it if I don't have to. What is this? Earthquakes. Oh, we're going to learn about the Christchurch earthquakes. Let's go. Resting on the boundary of the Pacific and Australian tectonic plates, New Zealand has earned its nickname, the Shaky Isles. With nearly 14,000 earthquakes each year, the country's seismic activity and volcanic features together make it one of the most unstable geological sites in the world. While most of the quakes are too small to be felt, severe damage has occurred as a result of larger quakes. The biggest quake ever recorded was an 8.2 in Wairarapa in 1855. Recently, the 2011 Christchurch earthquake caused massive loss of property and life. The main cause of earthquake-related injuries and deaths is falling debris. After the earthquake, other dangers are posed by landslides, aftershocks, tsunami, flash floods, and fires. 
Yeah. Um, when I lived there, I experienced two really big earthquakes and I left New Zealand with like a fear of earthquakes. They're so scary when they're really big, when they're really big and you're on the plate, it's like, <clears throat> it's scary. Oh, oh, okay. Landslides. <laughs> I've learned so much. Oh, you can click on this. Volcanoes. New Zealand lies on the notorious Ring of Fire, a horseshoe-shaped zone of volcanic activity <coughs> around the Pacific Ocean's tectonic plate. New Zealand's volcanism is concentrated on the North Island with three volcanic types, cone volcanoes, volcanic fields, and calderas. The last major eruption was at Mount Ru Ruapehu? Ruapehu? I'm sorry. I'm sorry for my Maori pronunciations. They're atrocious in 1995 to 1996 residents living near volcanoes are at risk from dangerous la lahars mud flow ash flo ash fall and rapidly moving gases and volcanic rock landslides landslides pose a serious threat in a terrain of mountains and unstable geographic features earthquakes heavy rainfall and man-made changes to the landscape all contribute to causing landslides which can range from a single boulder to a massive slide of earth and debris and occur with little to no warning and tsunamis as an island nation the entire coast of new zealand is at risk of tsunami how does anyone live there now now that i'm reading all this i'm like oh my god <laughs> maybe we should evacuate everyone from new zealand <laughs> um Tsunamis occur when waves are generated by a large and rapid displacement of water, the result of underwater earthquakes, underwater landslides, terrestrial landslides, or volcanic eruptions. Nothing goes right in New Zealand, apparently. A tsunami threat is classed by the distance of the triggering event. A distant tsunami takes more than three hours to reach the coast, regional takes one to three hours, and local hits land in under an hour. 80% of tsunamis occur in the Pacific Ocean. A clear warning sign of an approaching tsunami is a wave trow trow or trough or tr i hate english <laughs> and it's my first language this phenomenon causes seawater to recede from the shoreline shortly before the first wave of the tsunami arrives um so you know how i said i wanted to go back to new zealand i think i changed my mind raid shadow legends uh i'll figure this out later I'll leave that to be story related. What is this? What is this? I don't know. Okay, let's leave. Oh my God, besties, we can do some press. <laughs> Every time I see one of these, I'm just like, let's go. Time to pose. Oh, solve that's this. Done. Can't, that's done. Still have, can't, can't, haven't done ha, that. Ha, ha. Read up on the show notes. Complete the plant challenge. Flowers. Oh God. What? What I does? Need to put the plants in the correct vases. How do I know where they go? Kaka beak. Is it just this one, I guess? Let's see. Kaka beak. What if I go to base camp? Um, actually, that's not true. The Pacific Ocean is a myth perpetrated by our lizard overlords. <laughs> oh God. Nick has been brainwashed. Um, Kaka beak? How are you supposed to know which one goes to what? Team standing. We're winning. I don't know. <laughs> I can't tell. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Slay. <laughs> Thank you. Um, what's in the auction house? Oh, right. We just looked at this. Okay. 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 So what's in the training grounds? Oh, this is where I did this. All right. So I'm this bird. It's Red background, does it say what team I am? It does not. Okay, red background and then blue and black bird. Is 
So we're Team Tui. Okay. Team Tui. Uh, is this our tent? <gasps> it's me! Show rules. Ahem. George and Nancy, friends. <laughs> Just friends? Hi, Wolfsey. Thank you for the 67 months. Thank you so much. Do your own research, people. The truth is out there. I know a great Facebook group you could join. Section one, pre-arrival. Contestants may only bring pre-approved items to camp. Teams will be provided with a game phone for communication uh, between contestants and receiving stage instructions. Personal cell phones and other mobile devices are prohibited. Contestants requiring medical attention during the game will be evaluated by the production's medical staff. If injuries require the withdrawal of the contestant, the contestant's teammate may choose to continue solo or opt to withdraw from the competition. That's kind of a bummer. Shouldn't there be like a backup person? Competitors are strictly forbidden from entering the crew side of camp at any time. Not if those security cameras go down. Just saying. Each team will be assigned to a tent in the camp Activity stands in the field and a room in the Puzzle Palace. Teams are not allowed to enter or tamper with another team's area. This one is competition and medallions. Pacific Run is divided into five stages with one hidden medallion fragment in each stage. The first team to return to the current stage's medallion to the metal stand in the center of camp wins that stage. The winning team is the team to return all five medallions and have the most points. Challenges must be fully completed in order to unlock the next challenge. No player shall remove a medallion in the course of an active competition segment that does not belong to their team. At the end of, sta of a stage determined when the first medallion piece for that stage is returned, all teams are recalled to base camp. At that time, the two teams with the lowest total points will be eliminated. I have to sneeze. <coughs> Excuse me. Help from the non-participating teammate in individual challenges is forbidden. Excuse me. Section three, points. Team point totals are displayed at all times on the scoreboard in base camp. Teams can earn a maximum of 990 points. I'm going for 990, everyone. <laughs> I'm going for all of them. The first team to return their stage medallion to the medal stand will receive 100 points. Each subsequently returned medallion for that stage receives 10 points less, okay. Teams will receive individual challenges at random times during the competition. Bonus points will be awarded upon completion of these optional challenges. The value of the points will be noted in the challenge notification. Points may be used to purchase items at the auction booth. Teams must have a minimum of 50 points in order to purchase items. If a purchase would drop their total below 50, then they will not be permitted to buy it. Three types of bonus scorecards are hidden in locations throughout the game sites. The cards are award, points, and deduct. Uh, redeem bonus cards. At, at the scoreboard, award and points cards may only be used towards the competitor's own team. Deduct may be used against any team. <gasps> that himbo is going down. There's so many teams. Do I have to meet all these people? It's a lot of people. What's this? Native flora. Oh, this is what I need. Silver fern, a national symbol of New Zealand. The silver tree fern is named for the silvery white underside of its fronds. Also known by its Maori name, Ponga. The silver fern is medium-sized, reaching around 30 feet high with fronds up to 13 feet long. Generally found in drier forests or open scrub. Ah, oh, the silver fern. So I picked, oh, spider orchid. So that's handy to know, because um, there was a spider thing. I picked up the caca beak. This shrub belonging to the pea family produces a large red hanging flower clusters large red hanging flower clusters. Although rare in the wild, the caca beak is, popular, is a popular ornamental plant in gardens and planters. So where do you go? He <laughs> he, grow up, Nick. Hmm. Planters and flowers, I guess it would go here. It seems right. Okay, where are all these other flowers and why isn't George helping me? George? George is being useless. Doubtful sound. <gasps> I can leave? Ooh. Oh, this looks like another challenge. Where is George and why isn't she helping? <gasps> Flowers. Lily. Uh... 
You can't just back away from this because you're scared. I'm not scared. Yes, you are. So what if I am? I'm not doing it. It's wrong. It's not wrong. You're afraid. You're just afraid. It's unnatural. <laughs> I immediately thought of the, um, the homophobic dog. It's unnatural. Okay. Oh! This looks like some sort of code. Mm. Ooh. Patrick, take this note to the producer's tent and copy down all of the rules that normally lead to the player being forced from the show and write those rules down verbatim. Then secure this note in our tent, L. Note to self, Lena wants me to take this note to the producer's tent and copy down all the rules that normally lead to the player being forced from the show and write those rules down. Patrick, you're killing me, baby. I think you may have missed a very important step. Try again, please. Do you remember what I told you about my contract law classes? About how I need the exact language of the rules word for word from the producer's contract? I don't need the player rules. I need Sonny's copy of the show contract copied here. Look for a player may be expelled or may be escorted off the premises. <laughs> copy it down. Don't put it in your own words. If you get caught, just talk until they decide you're lost. This isn't a show contract. Sonny says it's missing. That makes no sense. Try again. I tried again. It was the same. So I tried it again, again. It was all still the same. I'm really struggling to read today. I don't know what's wrong with me, but like my brain is skipping words and like making up new words. <laughs> I'm struggling. All right. Looking like I'm sticking with the game rules. Candidates for ambiguity, removing medals, non-cancellation of deduct cards, card creation, not specified, sudden death. Additionally, language states players seen beyond bounds are eliminated. This does not specify who is seeing the activity. This might be quite useful. Wow. Also, what was on the right? Is that like a backpack? Hmm. I was born to kayak, but which boat is the one for me? I don't know. Take them all. Oh God, I'm gonna get lost. Where am I? Hello? Do I have to turn around? Okay. What is that? What is this? Cool. I wonder what's down there. Need to find a way to unlock this hatch. Okay. <gasps> Damn. I really thought that'd be it. <laughs> okay, let's leave. Uh, have I seen everything? I can't tell. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I thought it was funny. I went this way, right? I went this way. I feel like if I just flail around, I'll find something. Maybe I can't. What are you? All right, fine. Fine. Wait, how do I leave? <laughs> oh, it's this, right. It's the fast travel. BTS stands are typing. <laughs> Is this where we need to use the wool shed? No, we used that one already. We used that one already. Even if Bro Team was here, he couldn't read the hurtful words anyway. <laughs> Aww. Bro Team knows how to read. Wink. Wink wonk. Where are the rest of these flowers, dude? And again, I have to ask, why isn't George helping? She's supposed to be my teammate. Can I not just yoink these? Maybe one's at like the base camp. I feel like they'll be sprinkled around or something. I don't know. All right, let's go this way. Who's driving this bush? <laughs> have you been to the puzzle place? I have. That place is hilarious. What Why? makes it hilarious? I know, right? <laughs> What were you guys fighting about? I couldn't help overhear you fighting earlier. Lena wanted me to kayak. 
I hate water. <laughs> Why? I don't have any body fat. I'm like a gorilla. I just sink to the bottom. You can't swim? Can gorillas swim? I don't know. Well, someone told me they can't. Who would make up something like that? No one on the internet would ever tell a lie. Goodbye. Talk to you Never. another time. <laughs> okay. I can't go into his tent. What's up? Ready for this? I need you to help you me. Know it. What should we do first? Search for plants first, win second. Then gloating, if time permits. Sounds good. Why aren't you helping me? Any good advice on where to look for the plants? I'm working on it. You do your thing. What does that mean? Later. See you later. I'm looking for them right now. <laughs> can't, ch can't check. Unlock the map location for the plant challenge. Am I not supposed to be collecting plants yet? <sighs> oh, I have the flora book with me. Lily. An alpine plant found in the mountains of the South Islands, the Mount Cook Lily, is actually a white buttercup and not a lily. It is the world's largest buttercup. Buttercup. Cute. <laughs> she said do your thing, which is all the work, and she'll do her thing, which is watch cat videos on YouTube. That's what it's starting to feel like. <laughs> That's what it's starting to feel like. George is like, don't worry, I'm working on it. Um... None of this like explains where I think. Oh, this one also has a hmm. P. And this one mentioned it being a P. I'm gonna move these around really quick. I, I don't know. Um, unlock the map location for the plant challenge. Complete the plant challenge. Unlock it. From where? Did I miss something? Where do you unlock it? Hmm. You should always be collecting plants. <laughs> Vape nation. Where's Sunny? I want to talk to Sunny. I have questions. I have some questions. Please tell me I don't have to like play these silly games. Wool shed. Unscramble the password to moss burn. Oh! Oh, I see. I, I understand. Looks like I'll I understand. Need a I get it. I get it. I'm all right. I'm caught up, everyone. Don't worry. She made it eventually. <laughs> she made it eventually. Is this a barn? Yeehaw, everyone. Get on your cowboy hats. Is that a sheep? Do I hear a sheep? <gasps> it's locked. It's locked. Can I go in this way? No? I'm gonna hit on down to me push up. Oh God, this is scary. <gasps> I got a plant. I feel like I need like a knife or something to cut that, but I don't have one. <gasps> pretty! Alright, rope bridge. Where did you come from? pretty dangerous. You sure you want to do this? Uh, more than I've wanted to do anything. Oh my god. Bess? What is it? Is something wrong? Oh no, she's so fu- <gasps> Yes? She's so fu- <gasps> Oh, it's George! It's not even Bess! George is fucking dead! George? Oh, this is where they're like, Nancy's gonna continue alone. Last time on Pacific Run, <laughs> the world watched in stunned horror as tragedy struck George Fane. Today, a dark mood hangs over New Zealand as the remaining contestants grapple with the loss of such a brave young she's woman dead. from this season's cast. <laughs> oh Luckily my God. From Fane and our lawyers, she's resting comfortably and hopefully not feeling too litigious. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm so glad you're okay. No matter what, we're going to win for you. That's sweet of you, but you don't need to. And we'll find out what happened with the bridge. Okay, that might be nice. I'm was sorry you with. don't get to compete. I know how much you were looking forward to it. I'll get to watch, at least. Which reminds me, I have a producer feed. So, I just have to go to the television over there to hear them? Yeah, and hey, take this. 
just in case you need to sneak back and catch up. It's a key to the producer area. Just don't get caught. Are you proposing I cheat? George. No, just something odd is going on here. We George. might need to bend the rules. Stop. I'll take it. Well, I, I love do bending like rules. bending rules. <laughs> I know you do. Are you sure you want to help? I love her. This is a lot to do alone. Bess has volunteered to help. Bess? <laughs> Bess Marvin. Since when does Bess look like this? Contestant, Bess Marvin. Let's hear what she's got to say for Oh, herself. she's coming in? <gasps> she's gonna be my teammate. Ah! Yes, you are. <laughs> Well, yes. let's hope it doesn't come to that. And we continue Pacific Run New Zealand. I love this announcer. I hope she's not feeling too litigious. <laughs> Who are you? Hey there. What's it like dating a local celebrity? What's it like dating a local celebrity? You don't need to add that local modifier. I guess I don't know how important rugby <laughs> she's is She's so here. condescending. Eating, sleeping, rugby. Some people have other hobbies, but that's the official lowdown. Are you a fan? Used to be, but then my favorite player retired. Best looks like Jennifer Coolidge. We've just got so many Jennifer Coolidge references in all the games I've been playing. Wanna team up? Am I proposing an alliance? <gasps> Wanna team up? Nah, I'm good. I didn't want to be in an alliance with you anyway. You and Patrick are a very unique <laughs> couple. No. I know what you're getting at. He's got a depth most people don't see. Even he isn't aware of it sometimes. I'm not seeing it. I'm not seeing it. That's fine. I'm not trying to sell you on my boyfriend. I love her. She's very confident. Talk to you later. Bye. She's very, like, sure of herself. I love her. Uh, let's see. Anything else in here? Nor, nor. <gasps> Bess. Hello. Oh. Whoa, you look worried. She doesn't want to be I here. I look worried? I know you're upset, but everything will be fine. You do know that George is the cautious, capable one. That doesn't mean something bad is going to happen to you. Don't use your logic voice on me if you're not going to use your logic... logic. Fine. You might get hurt. <laughs> fine. You might die. Oh, that face. Yes. Please go back to lying to me. Honestly, whatever happens, I've got your back. All right. Well, bye. Oh, bye. <laughs> bye. I'll leave you with that to ponder on. See you later. <laughs> wow. Does he have anything to say? Uh, what? All I did is say hi, and he's like, what? <laughs> Bess, please don't yell. How long have you and Lena been together? I'm not the best with time. How's that? I don't know. Who invented the minute anyway? I have no idea. Maybe we should just go back to the drawing board. Uh, about what? <laughs> what do you mean? Go back to the drawing board? About time. <laughs> Jojo. Oh my god, is that an accent? <laughs> I'm about to objectify. You and Lena seem to complement each other pretty well. What? Oh, like a logical free thinker just yeah, like me. I'm good at that. Oh, God, you're so weird. Where were you when George was injured? With Lena. Where? Near the bridge. Did you see anyone near the bridge? Lena. Anyone else? No, just us. I'm not sure what's going on inside his skull. Bye-bye. Goodbye. I would love to be in there for just a minute. Like, for the people with anxiety in the chat, do you ever feel like there's like a hundred tabs open in your brain and you can't tell which one is playing music? I feel like he's got the opposite. I feel like he's just an empty desktop. No icons, no apps open, just empty. I want to know what it's like. Hey, come over here. Hello? I'm so sorry about George. Thanks. Looks like she's going to be okay. Same with Aaron. I heard she tried to save George. She did. Are you going home? No, nah, going on alone. You? Bess is joining me. The blonde with the day glow camera? Good luck with that. Hey, Bess is great. Nancy, I'm teasing you. At the end of the day, this So is her a game. partner tried to it's save George? Trash talk. That's all it is. I have a proposal for you. I'm listening. You and I should form an alliance. 
Right, but at the end there can only be one winner. So, what's the overall plan? Yes, McLeod. But, <laughs> I don't need to win. I need to stay around long enough to get screen time. I promised my agent I'd make it to the finals. You have an agent? Yep. Well, that's surprising, but I suppose I might be open to the thought of working together. Alliance? Good. Here's something. Consider it a show of good faith. Sonny June, the producer, he's not supposed to be the one running the show. What do you mean? I heard a conference call. Apparently, he trashed the travel paperwork for the actual crew. For real? I love for him. For real, yes. Sunny June is a menace to society. He's been a menace in every single video game, and I love him. Um, can I just say, my big brother watching Heart is like exploding right now that someone was like, I want to form an alliance with you. I'm like, yes. I would like that. As someone who grew up in New Zealand, do you think you have an unfair advantage? You know it. By the age of 10, every New Zealander knows how to find scattered medallion pieces. <laughs> it's the national pastime. You sure it's not sarcasm? I like you. <laughs> how did you get started in reality television? I can't wait till Janelle shows up. Show called Sleep I need her to rank huh. the Haven't accents. Heard of it. Basically, you'd go on a date after staying up for 24 hours straight. We went skiing, he died. What? Later, in a boat thing. Oh. Unrelated. <laughs> but I met the producer of the show and we hit it off. Oh my and god. that reality became my reality. I like her so much. I don't even remember what her name is, but I love her so much. What did you do before reality TV? This, that. Aerial arts paid the bills. I can't say I know what that means. She does you know flippy dippies. Arty French circuses? Oh, yeah. I did that. Never made the poster, but always made rent. Eventually, ish. Why did you stop? One day, you put on the spandex and the mirror glass coated antlers and it hits you. What hits you? It's sort of a specific feeling. I did the see the before, previous, yes. The day I saw yes. myself as an artist. The next day, I saw myself as absurd. So I quit. Aww. Been there, bestie. Been there. Where were you right before the bridge collapsed? In the confessional booth. Can you prove that? Maybe Sonny can? Why did you dedicate your life to being on trashy TV? You play it fast and loose with the judgments, don't you? <laughs> Sorry. You know what I my mean. Soul. You're smart and talented. Pfft, talent? No. <laughs> I'm not talented. I was raised to believe I was, and so were all my classmates. Well, everyone is special in different ways. No. Everyone's different. Very few people are special. And this is what led you to TV? Honestly, I this agree. This me up every day at four to take the bus into the city as a kid. Modern dance? I was good. Not good enough. I've got the drive and all that business. Just not the talent. Just a lifetime of coming in second. <gasps> TV gave you a way to win? That's so sad. It gave me something where it didn't matter either way. Something to burn off the energy. I'm a greyhound. Fame is a cruel sport. But I have a need to run. Okay. Okay. I'm ready to work with you. You won't regret this. You'll regret something else. What? <laughs> She's so threatening. I want to talk to her all the time. I have so many questions to ask her. Talk to you later. Later. <laughs> I think it's her. If it is, I'm in an alliance with her now. So, that's that. Check have it. Can't check that off yet. I'm not, I'm not going to question it. There's Sunny. Nancy Drew. I like his hair. It looks very good. This is like what Nick suggested I do with my hair. She's probably talking about the tacos we had for lunch. I'm already regretting those. Why is my butthole on fire? I heard a rumor that you're not supposed to be the one running the show. That's true. Well, what's the story? The main producer plane was diverted and their passport paperwork was filed incorrectly. And who was behind that? Me. I was uh, <laughs> a little overconfident in my knowledge A man after my own heart. Codes. Where did he send them? He got the airport codes confused. Where did they go? Are they in like Antarctica right now or something? What happened? Can I see footage of the bridge collapse? The footage was uh, destroyed, not in a fire, but in a magnetic thing. All of it? Yes. Is it okay if I check? No. Okay. They're also short with me. I feel like the Nancy Drew team got so many comments of like, oh my God, your characters talk so much. So they were just like, you know what? 
We're going to have characters that barely talk to you at all. Bye-bye. Cool, cool. None of these characters want to say anything all to right. me. Have you noticed anything odd about Sonny? Other than the fact that he's taken the show hostage? Yes. Okay, what have you noticed? The talking to no one was disturbing at first. But I grew accustomed to that. <laughs> what really got me was the talking to the Ohio! <laughs> huh? Yeah, but not in a cute way. In a sad, oh no, they got sent to Ohio. Me. What was he saying? This is so sad. What the content of his human to animal communication? They'll never be the same. Yeah, I guess that is what I'm asking. <laughs> it was mostly apologies. <laughs> What do you think Sunny is trying to do with the competition? Fly it into orbit? That's my best guess. I would. Sunny be crazy. If I ran a show, like a reality show? Goodbye. Bye. I'd want to just throw, like, if I had a reality show with, like, an unlimited budget, I'd be going bonkers with it. I think that'd be so fun. I'm not loving this Ohio slander. Sounds like someone lives in Ohio. <laughs> Why would you publicly tell everyone you live in Ohio, Jojo? It's, it's very brave of you to say. Um, I want to get in here. Let me in, please. I need flowers. I wonder if I can find any evidence uh, where the bridge snapped. Oh, they rebuilt it! Let's try this again. Ooh. Accidents will happen. The old bridge may have gone down, but a new and improved version will rise in its place. The new bridge is nearly ready for the finishing touches, but it's up to you to test the strength of the new design. <laughs> Not being quality assurance for a bridge. Starting at the blue square, see if the bridge is strong enough to support you in your journey. Step on each remaining square exactly once, ending at the red square. You can step forward, back up, or down a distance of one or two squares per step. Good luck, competitors. Is this a joke? I'm saving. <laughs> I don't feel safe. This puzzle is a tad bit insane. Oh my god, it's Squid Games. As a structural engineer can confirm, this is how we test structural stability in new construction. Oh, is it you? Are you the one that does this? I can go diagonal, right? This is insane. <laughs> okay, maybe not. This is ridiculous. Is that it? Oh, am I supposed to do every single square? Oh, I think you're supposed to do every single square. Why am I trying to destroy this entire bridge? Oh God. Uh, I think I messed up. Oh, I messed up. <laughs> I'm kind of mad you can't go diagonal. Like, come on. I could totally go diagonal. You're telling me I can jump two spaces but not go diagonal? I messed up, damn. We okay. Um, mm, uh, I think I messed it up again already. <laughs> I'm still mad you can't go diagonal. This is unfair. Oh no, I can't. Okay, fine. Um, I can't go this way and then go back because then I just get stuck.
I feel like I have to do these and go this way. But then from here, I'm like, where do I go? I'm scared. Uh... I don't know, dude. I'm not sure. Can you lower your cam a bit? I think it's covering part of the puzzle. The thing is, regardless of where I put my camera, it's gonna cover something. So I've reached a point with streaming where I'm like, you know what, my camera is just gonna cover some stuff because I can't. Everywhere I move it, people will be like, it's in the way of this. So I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um. Oh no, this is how I get trapped. Hee <laughs> hee. I trap myself. Whee! <laughs> um, this is really hard. That's what ends up happening. I end up moving my camera like every few minutes because it is always going to cover something. Uh. My wee little brain can process this. We can try. We can try. You're doing so good. Break the bridge. I'm trying. I can jump too horizontally, horizontally or vertically, but I can't jump diagonally, which I think is bullshit. I'd rather be able to jump diagonally than jump two spaces. Personally. It's just my own opinion. That's just my opinion. Um... I have no choice but to go here. <gasps> Let's go, gamers. Let's go. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Wait, what happened? I didn't even read it. Another exciting round comes to a close on Pacific Run, New Zealand. Team Kia has returned the first medallion. No! Remaining teams still have a chance to place their medallions for they second cheated. place. The brand from abroad puzzles. easily holds down victory, while her partner continues Lena to cheated. hold down a big old rock. In a surprise twist, by which I mean surprising to those of us who should be running the show, <laughs> location producer Sunny June has decided to bend the rules for Team Tui, sparing them some elimination. Thank you. So, Team Tui, enjoy the good luck. And Sunny June, don't make us come down there, young man. My Tata partner just was died. so lucky, and will be rowing the kayak of shame out to lose her atoll. Where they will sit among sheep and reflect on their elimination until the competition oh my comes God. to a close. It's like Limbro in F Boy Island. You're in loser jail now, dorks. <laughs> Stage two, ready. Get a bag, shear a sheep, and drop the bag of wool in the bin in the wool shed to earn your next medallion. So what about the flower one? Can't st st have to still have to do that. I st I need to do the flower stuff. <gasps> hmm. Oh. There must be a way to block the camera's sight lines. Wait, what? I'm so confused. What? Oh! Can I only do, t oh, I only have two blocks. I see, I see. That's pretty wild. I only have two. Oh. Wow. This is hard. Oh. Do I have to do this every time? Jed, thank you for the 58 months. Thank you so much, I appreciate it. Wow, so nice. Wowie wow. Do 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 
Hmm. <gasps> Whoa. Oh my god, this one is like the winner. She's a winner. Oh, but if I only have three, then like, probably not. <sighs> Why is this so hard? Please. Beep, boop, beep, doop, deep. <laughs> Good morning, Asian. How you doing? Mr. Asian Sensation is awake. Everyone, please rise for our king. Uh, it's this one that's really like pissing me off. This one's really grinding my gears. I don't like it. <laughs> I'm like really good at this game. Um, which one hits the most? Hmm. Hmm. I see. <laughs> Easy. That was nothing. Nothing. Why can't I storm the porta potty? <gasps> oh. Spied strange phenomenon inspectors, extraterrestrial division. Sonny, you're mad if you go through with your plan. Here's the mock-up of your new pamphlet. You are aware it makes no sense. Yeah, please call me Jamila. Okay, hold on. J-O-2-0-4-9-6-0-4-2-3. Okay. Oh my God, did he write a book? Dear Earthling, hello, I am a booklet. Don't let the let fool you. Like most books, I have a message I've been asked to bludgeon you with until you agree that yes, until you agree that yes, you agree. Of course I agree, you'll think. Then the bludgeoning will resume for six more times just to make completely certain that you agree. What? For more information on the subject of constellations, refer to our pamphlet number 9x5q. We at Spied care little for constellations. Ooh. Aliens, fact or fiction? Or fact and fiction. <laughs> the study of alien life is based on a false premise that the aliens are not already here. This misunderstanding is understandable and dates back to the earliest sky paleontologists who looked up at the stars and never had the sense to think, that, w that one there is where elephants come from. <laughs> The best they could do was to muse, those eight stars look like a man wearing a hat. We at Spied care little for constellations. Oh my god, this is ridiculous. The unanswered questions, specifically those questions not answered in chapter three. What? In chapter three, we asked whether aliens were real. A silly question to begin with, but it appears we then were sidetracked on the subject of constellations. We do apologize. Where are our manners? We know where they are, not a written connect the dots style across the night sky. What? What is grammar? <laughs> Team Suzuki, thank you for the 14 ones. Thank you so much. Pardon me. I took a little walk and feel much better. It's just a very offensive practice, superimposing galactic graffiti. Excuse me. Oh, perfect civilization of Earth. Nice job dictating the interstellar skyline. We took another walk. We're cool now. Oh my god, dude. This is ridiculous. What does it all mean? Spied has no idea. If you have any idea, join Spied. <laughs> oh my god. This is ridiculous. Show rules. This is all stuff I've read already. Shani. Our math was wrong. The window isn't five years from now. It's now. I'm looking for the gear. I'm looking for the gear works. 
You must go to New Zealand today, gather the chosen and find the artifact. Take my notes, learn what you can. I have lied to you more than I have told you the truth. Later, later I will tell you why, but for now I can only apologize. Let's talk space, my boy. <laughs> we Junes belong to a special organization called the An Anunnaki. It's a name many people associate with an alien race, due in large part to a disinformation campaign we've carried out. It is very difficult to talk about aliens without sounding like a fool. I formed Spied for that very purpose, to make ourselves seem silly and harmless. In truth, we keep a secret so great it must be hidden in plain sight to confuse anyone following our movements. Our mission, to keep the world from exploding. Whoa! So Jin is Sunny's grandfather. Hi, Avia. Hi, BB. Is this why Sunny's here? It's good to see you. Thank you for 52 months. Wow. 50 and two. Thank you. Dear Earthling, hello. I am a subject. Don't let the sub fool you. <laughs> like most subs, I have a message I've been asked to bludgeon you with until you agree that yes, you agree these nuts. Damn. I've been gotten in my own stream. This is so sad. <laughs> Bro's trying to reach the word count so hard. <laughs> Just up the font size of all the periods like the rest of us. It's not that hard. <laughs> the testers have given us guidance at each step of our development. They taught us to make tools. They taught us to build. They sent one of their own to teach us how to unwind the atom. And that is where we remain. They need us to prove that we deserve our next lesson. To make that happen, we must survive the mounting dangers of our world long enough to assemble the artifacts and send the beacon. I'm following one lead in the Nordic in the Nordic countries. I need you to follow another in New Zealand. I've left instructions hidden in our own way to the reputed locations of the artifacts. Find them before it's too late. These are memories I meant to share with you in person, but now, but now there isn't the time. The day will come when I will tell you the full tale of the Anunnaki. For now, I can only show you fragments, reflections. Salvage what you can of the comics, study them. Tease out the truth and pursue it. Use force if you must. Your grandfather, Jin Su Sung. Wow. Grandpa wants to find aliens. I can't blame him. I would too. Welcome back. We're going to play more Nancy. Can you hear me okay from this distance? Because having a mic up in my mouth feels weird. Can you hear me like this? We can. Okay, good. Yes. Okay, let's continue. We play more game. Um, what else? Let's see. We're we're sneaking through Sunny June's uh, room. <laughs> what? I need more ads. All right. Well, I guess we'll just <laughs> leave the let the stream be ads. Oh, I forgot to post the sesame pick in Discord. Hold on. Give me a second. Give me one chicken. Hold on. Okay, I put it in I put it in Discord. This is my son. That's him right now. That's him next to me right now. I love him so much. I love my angel. Okay. Uh The Tales of Laika and Sunny June. You worry too much. Isn't this the thing that George just died on? Yes, I saw the new Just Dance preview. <laughs> Are we keeping a tally of how many times I've been asked if I've seen the new previews? <laughs> That's got to be like at least a hundred. It could be safe. Creek. What is what is it like? Oh, waffles. <laughs> nah. And then yeah, he's dead. I'm gonna have to figure out what's inside of this. Yes. Knowing Sunny, I'd better figure out the Ugh. combination before messing with that. What would it be? What would your combo be? I should just ask him what his birth year is and I'll figure it out. <gasps> uh oh. Nancy didn't even try to hide. She didn't even try. My queen. Oh, I can watch the confessions? That feels illegal. We've noticed a lack of any special skills in your application. <laughs> I have skills. Could you list those skills? That's not something I have to do often. They said you're literally useless. <laughs> what do you have to say about that? 
There's more than a competition here, but still, I'd like to win. Did you notice that Sunny's only focusing on some of the teams? <laughs> Nancy Day! Hi, Zoe. How you doing? You don't seem that upset about losing your teammate. Isn't that a touch suspicious? I'm not saying I cut the bridge, but if I did, wouldn't that be something now? Any insights about your fellow contestants you'd like to share? <laughs> it's so easy to mess with Bess. It's not even worth it. Still. Let's leave Kiri to her thoughts of teasing fish in a barrel. <laughs> Why are they all making fun of Bess? They're being so mean to Bess. You seem a little overqualified to be here. Oh Nothing my god. With that. What's just dance? <laughs> I've never heard of it before. I'm not talking about that bridge. Leave it be. That poor girl got hurt, but not my fault. I was supposed to be there for the contest. Mm -hmm. Nancy teaming up with Kiri. Not a smart move, but I'll let it happen. There you have it. Uh, Patrick? Oh god, I can't wait to hear what goes on in his mind. What do I do? This is where you share your darkest secrets. Oh, confessional booth. Okay. I stole some food from the craft table. Generally, people talk about other contestants. Is that what oh, you're supposed, supposed to do? to talk about the other people. That's it. What? <laughs> Not a thought behind those eyes, Patrick. My name is Patrick. Uh, this is the confession booth. I used to be a pro rugby player for New Zealand. This is my first time on reality television. Not my first time in reality. Or my first time on television. <laughs> I think his actor might be actually Kiwi. Because, like, usually in Nancy Drew games, they, like, hide... Um, uh, they, they like hide the accents by just hiring like Americans to do the accents, but then they do a terrible job. <laughs> you can say just dance. It's just that there's been like a hundred people today who have like, have you seen the new previews? And I'm like, yes, yes, I've seen it. Oh my God. <laughs> you seem pretty driven to win. I've seen it. I've won a lot of things. This couldn't hurt. You want me to talk about the waterfall? Yeah, we were there. She didn't want me to talk about it. I think she still doesn't. He's okay. motivated well, and built something. as solid as the rocks in the Hi, box that is likely referenced when describing his smarts. Who are they? I consider myself a student of the medium. Reality television is much maligned, but I maintain it is the height of the art. It's a visceral expression of human joy and loss and love. Hi, Janelle! And I truly respect the form. It's a New Zealand Nancy Drew game. It's one of the newer ones. I know. We need you to we need you to rank we need you to rank the accents because usually in Nancy Drew games, they hire like Americans to do the accents, but they do a terrible job. So we're trying to figure out if they're actually Kiwi. I think two of them are actually Kiwi. Um, let me go back to the main menu. I think she's actually Kiwi. You don't seem that upset about losing your teammate. Isn't that a touch suspicious? I'm not saying I cut the bridge. But if I did, wouldn't that be something now? She kind of sounds cute. Any insights about your fellow contestants you'd like to share? <laughs> it's so easy to mess with Bess. It's not even worth it. Still. Let's leave Kiri to her thoughts of teasing. She sounds Kiwi to me. This guy sounds the most Kiwi. He's a professional rugby player and he's got nothing going on in his mind at all. My name is Patrick. Uh, this is the confession booth. I used to be a pro rugby player for New Zealand. This is my first time on reality television. He's definitely Kiwi. There's no way. Hi, Witchy. How you doing? Who's Team Kiwi? I'm 86 years young, and I'm just tickled to be on the show. Now, is this going to be on streaming? My grandson loves streaming. <laughs> Granddad, he says, I don't have time for commercials. I love to stream things, and I love my very long skateboard. <laughs> I do love my very long skateboard. Big, long skateboard fan. My name is Olivia. I am a former personal chef. I quit my job to come here. It was a risk, but I'm very confident we'll win. Didn't they get kicked off already? Who got eliminated? <laughs> Why me? We didn't even make the first round. I have to fly home to my family now, and they'll say, how, how did it go? And I'll say, oh, it was super fun. And they just didn't ruin my life. <laughs> Does anyone need a personal chef? I'm really good. Oh, sorry. 
Anyways. <laughs> Look, I can't be popping in here. I need to be on my game. So uh, let's just bang these out. Why I'm does he sound like Joe here. Rogan? <laughs> Start tape. You're already rolling? Then let's go. All right, uh, Slate, Betrayal, Generic, Male. I can't believe he threw me under the bus. Slate, Betrayal, Generic, Female. I can't believe she threw me under the bus. All right, Slate, Betrayal, Pending, My Own. Look up. Those aren't stars. That's bus. I put you there. That's uh, bus. Slate, Confidence, General. I own it everything. Slate, Devastated. I can't even talk. He sounds like, um, I think that's the same actor that did the Nico voice in The Deadly Device, the one that we played where you're in, like, the science lab and the guy dies, the scientist dies because, like, the Tesla coil was tampered with or whatever. He sounds like him. I am going to win because I am an amazing singer. I oversoul like no one on this earth. Listen to this. Hey! You don't even know what note I was going for. I'm just that good. You are correct. I had no idea what note you were going for. Not a clue. Uh, this I one? made a huge mistake. Can I make a call? I can. I'm just going to go home. Is that okay? Why is New Zealand so far away from everything? <laughs> I, mean, I look at the map and I start to panic. There's nowhere to go but New Zealand. <laughs> just water. So much ocean. Why am I here? <laughs> That's so true. New Zealand is the asshole of the world. <laughs> I love it there. You need to ask Sunny about the clues you've been finding. Oh sure. my god. Why? Well, he keeps asking about my sleuth friend and what she's up to. It's like he's been getting impatient. That's me. I'm sleuth friend. Should I trust Kiri? I'll look into her history. She looks tired. Kiri thinks Sunny hijacked the show. That would make sense. How so? Well, you know I'm a huge Pacific Run fan, and I can tell you that this season <coughs> is way off. I mean, first the crew is non-existent, and normally you travel the whole Pacific, hence the name. Why are we focused on this one area? Thanks. I don't know. Should we be worried? A little. All right. George, put your toes away. We're on the internet. I think I need your help researching. Can you do that? Nancy! I'm scandalized. It could get us kicked off the show. I'm not looking to cheat. But you want I? the goods on everyone who's here. I know. I started. <laughs> Check my tablet for updates. I have a hard time staying. <laughs> oh my god, did she actually fall asleep? <gasps> Nancy, I'm not going to be much help. I knocked my head on a lot of different rocks. But anything I find out, I'll put right here. Ask me anything you want. For starters, you should be following up on what Sunny accidentally played during the opening. What did he mean by needing many specific talents? Also, I think I saw someone maybe cutting the bridge. It's a little blurry in my memory. Sunny's been sending the crew on crazy missions all over the country. He talks to them on live feeds sometimes. Actually, they usually just yell at him. The show is rushing through a lot of paperwork to get here. Sunny seems a little worried. Here's the first batch. Patrick is large. Sorry, still need to work. Uh, figuring him out. I hit a brick wall with Lena right away. She's got high security clearance, and I think she works with data encryption. She wouldn't tell you if she did, so don't bother. <clears throat> Odd that she's here, and now for Sunny. Real name, Seung Jun. Seung Jun. Run, uh, run spied an organization started by his grandfather. I'm looking into it now. Patrick was considered a big deal before his abrupt retirement. His interviews with the rugby press are interesting. When asked why he retired, he blamed a river. He's either sly like a fox or sly like a rock. I'm looking into everyone I can. First up is Kiri, local girl, former aerialist, contortionist, repeat reality TV competitor. I'm looking into it. Uh, on the pack run side, I've got a hot tip. You get bonus points for winning Raid and Monster in the Puzzle Pals. <gasps> wow. I want to win. Oh, I went in here already. Okay, cool. I hope my reading in this game is over because I'm sick of reading. I don't want to read anymore. Um, sly like a pebble. <laughs> We're so proud of our king, so sly. Um, I don't think I... Did I get to fully cross the bridge? Oh, no, I didn't because they stopped the challenge. Oh, it was only to get this. Okay. Well, I don't... 
I don't know if I can get the rest of the plants yet. I guess the plants are just gonna have to wait. Hello? Hey, Sonny came to talk to me. He wants to, me to review the blueprints of some machine. Notes on my tablet if I'm out when you come. <laughs> if I'm asleep, you can just log into my account. Sharing equipment. Hello? Phone access and a map password awarded to those who solve the Puzzle Palace's latest challenge. Okay, well, I'm... Why do I have so many challenges? Is it just me, or are they giving me, like, 5,000 things to do? I need to get the totals to add up to 20. Oh, God. Uh... Wait, what? Stop! <laughs> Leave me alone. I got a breakdown on everyone still in the competition for you. Check the tablet. More on the tablet as I keep digging. Kiri, local girl for... I already read this. I read all of this. So does this subtract? I'm s I'm so confused. Okay, so subtract eight. I could subtract nine from both of these. Um... No. Oh. What the heck? today I've gotten so lucky I've gotten so lucky oh is this when I was supposed to read up on the breeds oh I did not read anything about the breeds I'm so sorry what are... in stone Southland what I'm so what is going on I'm lost This must be the sheep to shear. I need to get the shearing machine powered on and working. Okay. The blades on the shearing machine need to be replaced. I can handle that. Okay, is that what these are? No, flint. This must be where the bag of wool needs to go. Okay, thank you. Do I put flint in here? No. <laughs> okay. I'm more than willing to make Nancy explode if I do something wrong. I have no issue with this at all. I need a key to get this working. Explode. I dare you. And then I need to replace the blades? How? The Coco Kringle Bar! Let's go. I love Coco Kringle Bars. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, shearing blades. <gasps> hmm. The shearing motor must be jammed. Oh my god. What isn't wrong with this thing? Where is the motor? I need to get all of the blades flat. What is it? What? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> huh? How are these moving? I'm so confused. Where did they go? Did I do it right? Oh, all the blades did need it. to be- Oh! <laughs> what is going on with my brain today? I'm so confused. I need to find a bag for the wool first. <laughs> I don't understand. Usually I start crying because these games are so hard, but like, hmm. this is wild. Where are the bags? I want to win. I need to win this one. Where are you keeping the bags? Hmm. 
Why? Why am I struggling? Are they like outside? Because they're not. Oh. I'm hmm. this one. Are they outside? Where are the shearing bags? Oh no, I don't see anything out here I can click on. Huh? Thank you, Gustavo! <gasps> How was it? How was the concert? Did you have fun? I loved Dua Lipa in concert. She was fun. I don't see bags anywhere. I'm lost, son. I figured, hmm, you'd just be hmm. able to. Hmm. Where the bags? That's can't. That can't. Did did. Have, that that's done. Can't, can't. Haven't done that. Um, the phone challenge at Puzzle Palace. We'll challenge. Dude, where? Where are the bags? All right, chat. Will someone? This is my. This is my code word. You can. You can backseat. Where do I find a bag? I would like a bag, but I cannot find one. But you may tell me the answer. I don't know. <laughs> chat, where are the bags? Wrong answers only. Yeah, no actual helpful answers, please. Have you checked the bag store? Damn. I hadn't thought of that. <laughs> Do I need to buy one from the little thing? <laughs> the one time I give you guys permission to backseat and you don't even want to backseat? Chad, are you okay? You've barely backseated streamer today. What's wrong? <laughs> what is it? Maybe they sell it at the, the campsite. You'll figure it out eventually. <laughs> Thanks. Like, this is what I was thinking of. Oh my god, you do have, have to, to buy it. 50 points in reserve. Okay, so, oh, sorry, Sesame. This is ridiculous. All right, Puzzle Palace it is. What is this? Oh. <gasps> ah! What happened? Why can't I even look at it? Okay, anyways. <laughs> Let's see if I can find all the words. <gasps> oh my god, I love these. Um, Moana is on here. Bun dun dun dun. Bun dun dun dun. Dun 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 dun. Excuse me. Bum bum, dun dun, bum dun, dun dun. Tai, Tai, I'd like to issue an apology to all Maori people. I am butchering this language. I'm so sorry. Uh... Where are you? Uh, kia ora! That's a greeting! Um, kia ora. Where are you? Hmm. Um, is it hangi? Hangi? No, wrong one. Oh, I found one of them. Um, there you are. Tamariki. Do, 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 do. More, Morena. Dun, 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 
dun 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 dun. I am not even gonna try with this one. Doku doku. There it is. Um, Fada Nui, Fada Nui. Oh, I found another one. I found a different one. Fada Nui. There we go. Tonga. Fenua. Fenua. All done. Yay! Doubtful sound. Doubtful that must be sound. The password to the hatch. Oh, to the hatch? What's this? Hello? Who would you like to call? Jamila. 020 <gasps> We're about to get the information. I'm so excited. Who is this? Nancy. Nancy who? Close. It's Nancy Drew. <laughs> oh, I remember you. From Egypt. That's right. Funny. Well, Doc, where are you calling from? New Funny. Zealand. So Sunny found you. It would appear so, yeah. Are you in any immediate danger? No. <laughs> that was a good one. certain about that. I'm glad you're doing okay. At least until now. Can I call you back? I just called. You wouldn't know the combination to Sunny's footlocker, would you? Oh. He never remembers those things. He hides the codes he needs in the spy booklets we put together, which I happened to edit just the other day. So, Got it. take the number in Chapter 2, the lower number of the Constellation pamphlet, the number from the UFO he's drawn in Chapter 6, and the chapter reference in Chapter 5. You remember that, Hold on. but not Wait. the combination? I, I can't even that. write that down! But if you're going to snoop on Sonny, you'd better be able to explain how you solved it. Otherwise, he'll know I helped. Uh, bye. Bye bye. Talk to you when I can. Okay. Well, she's very helpful. I like Jamila. Um, cool. Che haven't can't can't check that off yet. Can't check that off yet. Doubtful sound. Can I spend my points yet? Oh no! I need ten more. Okay, let's go play one of the puzzles. This is hard. Hello from Sweden. Hi. How are you? Uh, what is this one? Easy. What the heck? Oh my god, it's magic. What? What is happening? Are we battling each other? Oh, this is just magic. Easy. Easy peasy. <gasps> Let's go, gamers. Uh, I'm gonna fight purple with, uh, oh, this person. <gasps> murdered. You've been murdered. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you're feeling better. I'm glad you're feeling better. I finally just got over my, uh, I got a COVID vaccine, like the booster shot. Um, a few days ago. That was rough, dude. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm glad it's done, though. I'm glad I got it. But, wow. That was a lot. <laughs> that was hard. Where did mine go? Am I here? Oh, you're gonna fight me? Uh, you can have this one. Oh, I died. Wait, what? How did I win? I don't understand how I won. I'm very confused. Nice. I'm gonna fight you since you picked me last time. Oh, I just took their card. Oh, never mind. Oh God, Kel, I'm so sorry. I hope you feel better soon, it's rough. I'm gonna pick a smaller guy. I can get rid of him. Oh, I got wrecked. <laughs> What an ass. I'm 
I don't think I'm gonna win this one. This is very like luck related. <laughs> Honk. Um, you know what? I'll use my Donkey King. Nice. What? This is illegal. I'm sick of this. Let me take a turn. I just need points. I need to buy a bag. I need one bag. I'll use this guy. I mean, I didn't look at like the rules or anything. Oh my God, fuck this game. This game is trash. Let's do this one instead. <laughs> this game is trash. And takes too long. So this is where I'm guessing. Oh, I get to be the monsters this time. I'll choose this one. This one, and this one. Done. I'm just gonna infect everyone. Choose a cow to kill. Oh. Let's kill uh, this one. <laughs> Move scared cows slash monsters. Uh. <laughs> killed any of my monsters. This is too easy. This is too easy. I'm cleaning up right now. kill any cows without them knowing it's me, so. Oh, well. Damn! No kills available. Did I win? Why did they all need to be playing at the same time? This is what a tummy sounds like at 2 a.m. after Taco Bell. A tummy? A <laughs> dum dum. Oh, I need to move my cows. Okay. How come they got to move all the way over there? Oh, so it's you. It's you then. Dork. Um, choose another cow or pass? Choose another cow for what? Guess the hit. Oh, oh no, I didn't, oh no. Oh no, I didn't want to do that. Oh. Oh no, I'm gonna kill one of my own cows, okay. I'm so sorry, I didn't know what I was doing. So it's you. It's you. It's you, bitch. I see you. Pass. Wait, who died? Was it... What? I'm so confused! I still have to guess when there's no kills? If there's no kills available, then maybe this one? Nice. Nice. I win. How much how many points do I win? How many points? Please tell me I won at least 10 points. Oh, thank God. God, they made this difficult. Okay. Um, so 
Uh, right. Let's go here. Let's finish this, um, sheep stuff. Dude, I'm on a roll today. Let's go. Where's my medallion? Where's my medallion? Looks like someone got here first. No! <laughs> oh my god, I can't win anything! This is a disaster. Hi, Carla. How you doing? This is rough. Now on Pacific Run, New Zealand. They say it's a poor shepherd who blames his sheep. But even if not one contestant located a single sheep, congratulations, Team Kia. Remaining they cheated. teams still have a chance to place they their cheated. medallions for second place. Except teams Kakoa and Korea Ria, Boo. who have been shorn from the competition you and suck. must now flock to the shameful shores of Loser Atoll. <laughs> loser Atoll to go hang out with the other losers. <laughs> oh my god. What is this? Haven't done that. <laughs> Bess, when are you gonna start pulling some weight See around here? See something interesting? I'm sorry, I'm looking at Sunny. Okay. Pretend I'm talking to you about something, but I'm not. Sure, we're talking about something else. I just want to look at him. He's like one of those tall, beautiful things they have in Italy. Not sure, uh, Is this sculpture? The Sims 3? They uh, do kinda look like barista. Sims 3 models. Those aren't limited to Italy. Pretty much anyone who- Yes, yes, keep saying words. Bess. I can almost picture him with a puppy, and it's perfect. Bess? Shh. Bess. Bess, what? Yes, what? Do you want to maybe put that sunny enthusiasm to work? You know I do. OK. Go see if you can pry any information out of him. Are we looking but at the same like sunny Wiles. <laughs> sunny? That sunny? Is something bugging you? Yeah. Well, what? Sonny, there's something about him I can't figure out. He's mysterious. I know, right? We've got to see what he's up to. We're on the same page. Good. But if we get caught in his tent, we'll be kicked out. If mm -hmm. we get caught. Yeah, I'm sure this will end well for all involved. Mm-hmm. I need your help distracting Patrick. Got it. I need to go snoop in his tent. I need to... Oh. And she's here too? I saw you in the out of bounds area. Are you sure? What's the game? What are you after? Just visiting George. That might be true. So I'll let it slide for now. If you do me a favor. What's that? Ask Sonny if this means anything to him. The Beginner's Guide to Code Breaking, a guide for travelers and their dogs. But that great tree was struck by lightning right as it dawned on her. I've got it. What? Maybe this is what he's looking for. See how he reacts. Don't tell him it came from me. All right. Did you take our medallion? Hmm. Right. Section two, middle paragraph. No player shall remove a medallion in the course of an active competition segment. So that's a no? Did you not read the rules? I skimmed. You want a free tip? Is there such a thing? Only when it doesn't matter. Here's how you win anything. Read the rules. Losers see rules as limitations. Winners see rules as a direct path to winning. I'll keep that in mind. Ten bucks says you'll never read the rules. Mm-hmm. Well, she's gone, so that's all What's that matters. Up, man? Oh, hello. I'd better figure out the combination first. Why is there always a combination? Oh, I have the thing for that. Uh, three, zero, eight? <gasps> I'm in. I think I need more information to crack this code. Doubtful sound. Oh, doubtful sound. Oh my God, can I keep this? Oh, I can keep it. Okay, good. <gasps> oh, yoink. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. I don't need this. What's this? Mine. Mine. <laughs> bye. It's all mine now. Bye-bye. Stage three unlocked. Follow the butterflies to find the five pieces of hey tiki hidden underwater. Return the completed figurine to the tiki turn-in. I'm still trying to do this plant challenge, bro. I'm struggling. 
<laughs> I am struggling. I'm not doing well. Wait, can I go into this other tent? <gasps> What's in here? Literally just this. And that's it. Boring. You're not even hiding anything interesting. Okay, well, anyways. <laughs> they want that evil Just Dance lady to dance to Wide Awake. Why Wide Awake, specifically? Can't, can't, did, can't check that off yet. Um... Is doubtful sound? Did she say that's the password to the hatch? That would be a really boring password because then it's just like password is the password. Are you serious? Hi, Jojo. How you doing? The password was literally the name of... Oh, this is the Tiki turn-in. Ah. I need to match that image in order to charge the claw. No. I hate these. I hate these. Oh, my God. Oh, no. This is a mess. Can I turn it? Oh, I can't. I just have to figure it out. All right, well. Do I have to do another one? It's about time I got to pilot a sub. Oh my god. Okay. I think we're gonna save this puzzle for the next time I play this. <laughs> I think we're gonna stop here. Um, I still have this video to work on, so I feel like this is a good stopping point.